Hi, hi everyone. <laughs> um, wow, he's taller than me. Yeah, supposedly. Um, really, in real life, I'm not taller. Um, today, we are, uh, this is an introductory video to our channel. Uh, we will be talking about finances. Who doesn't like finances? Um, and today we will talk about our journey, uh, we're just starting out, sharing what we are doing, maybe you guys can open up a table for everyone else to chip in and comment what you guys do differently and just hopefully learn and grow with us. What do you think? Yeah, okay, that's good. Yeah, that's a good uh, intro. All right. We started investing early in our careers. Um, I got my 401k three years. Two years ago? Two years ago. Started working three years ago. And then um, after the first year, because I wanted to kind of catch up on my student loans on the first year. And then I contributed to my 401k at the match that my company was doing. Uh, so I'm contributing 5%, I think 5 or 6% the, that my company is matching. <laughs> Wells Fargo uh, basically manages my 401k. So I didn't have any financial education whatsoever and I don't know much about 401k and stocks and auctions. So, and that's one of the reasons why we started doing our joint account. Yeah, we started our joint brokerage account using Charles Schwab. We started it um, together as a couple. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we talked about this before. We started doing our joint account since January 1st and uh, we talked about this before uh, and different options of doing our joint finances and we picked the Charles Schwab uh, brokerage account, uh, checking account with brokerage, uh, how did it, like checking yeah, it's brokerage. A, it's a checking and brokerage, you get both. Uh, when you sign up for Schwab, but prior to having to opening up the Charles Schwab account, I had a Robinhood account, and with the Robinhood account, I invested, let's just say, maybe five hundred dollars. Yeah, like around there, and then it, I think it was in twenty sixteen. So since twenty sixteen to now, twenty twenty. And since we opened it with Charge Fund, which was in January 2020, um, I've made about a little, I've made double, at least a little more than double my initial investment. So I have like $1,100 in my Robinhood, which is nothing. It's, I'm not trying to you know, brag or anything, but I was trying to show that we can, you know, make more money through investments. Um, that's why you know, I proposed the idea of opening up a joint brokerage account. Uh, that way we could both contribute. We finally decided on uh, going ahead with this on Jan. Like we started doing it on January first. So we both contributed how much in the beginning? Five hundred. Five hundred each. Yeah. All right. So yeah, we contribute five hundred each, and our initial plan was to put in two hundred a month. Uh, hundred a month. Like a hundred or two hundred a month, mm -hmm. and then you know slowly do that monthly, you know, until the first year, and then we'll see like how much our return was, and then maybe upon that, then we can say oh. You know, because we made this much, you know what, we'll put in more. Uh, but things has changed um, due to a world shift, a paradigm shift in the world. Um, we are quarantined, right? And we decided to put in more money. But I think a little before that, um, we put in a little more than 200 just just to have it there all right and then after that we saw this paradigm shift and we said how about we contribute more into it within this last four months of our joint brokerage account journey 
We contributed uh, how much? Maybe 3,500. Something like that. And yeah. then uh, if you pick the Charles, it's not in the advertising. No, no, no. About 4,000. 4,500. Uh, so if you pick Charles Schwab, it does come, if you invest it in my money, it does come with some perks, like I think we got extra $100. Through a referral. So if you have a referral, you get an extra $100 and that's how much we got. Up to $100, I think you could get more, uh, depending how much you deposit inside. We'll have um, our referral link in the description below. And then you can start your investment journey too. And then uh, we had a uh, kind of... Uh, a real journey of ups and downs in the last four months because of uh, this paradigm shift that we uh, were discussing and initially we started off pretty strong uh, so pretty solid gains uh, due to mostly that the stocks that you picked right and uh, later we with the paradigm shift everybody in, like the economy was kind of uh, hitting the lows and losing points, so we lost uh, some money, not a little, like crazy amount like some people most likely, but uh, still uh, there were losses. And now we are uh, also thinking of investing more into uh, certain companies and uh, we can talk about which, why do we pick certain stocks over others. All right, we'll talk about that in another video. And we'll talk about um, why we pick Charles Schwab in the next video. If you guys would like to be a part of our journey and learn uh, with us as well, it's because we're not professionals, we don't have any uh, financial degrees, we're just amateurs like you and, and trying to trying to navigate uh, to the financial freedom uh, through this economy and our uh, capabilities at this time. So yes, yeah, so if you'd like to be a part of this journey, uh, please feel free subscribe and give a like give a like and in the next video we'll talk a little bit more as to our background sounds good okay subscribe eat eat <laughs>